morning, Captain. Yes. Where once again we have even shorter titles than ever before. <laughs> Welcome to the Morning Cup, Page Arizona's Morning Show. Thank you guys for being here, and thank you for liking, commenting, and sharing on all of these videos, even though Facebook rarely notifies you that we actually exist. <laughs> even though you told it that you would like to know. Oh. What are you, are you going to make it over there? I am, I am. Yeah, just before the show, she was about ready to die, so it, yeah. what's going I, on. I here. inhaled my hot coffee rather than, you know... Uh -huh. <laughs> You're not supposed to inhale the coffee, Lois. That is only a, a figure of speech. Uh, yeah, well, <laughs> apparently my body did not realize it today. <laughs> oh, Jerry says, good morning, good morning, Good morning, Jerry. Jerry. Good to see you. Thanks for joining us. Jerry says, good morning, good morning everyone. everyone. Hi. <laughs> and Michael's saying good morning, and Indigo saying good morning. Good morning. Hi, guys. Thank you for being here today. We do appreciate it, yes. even though Facebook is trying to keep you down. <laughs> I tell you what, man, we've been fiddling with different stuff, trying to find our way around the algorithm, and it just depends on the day. I tell you what, Aye, that's annoying. Oy, oy, oy. <laughs> so, as you can see, today is just morning cup with us. We'll see how that one does, shall uh, yeah, we? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it already looks like it's doing better. It so apparently, shorter is better. Maybe if I just leave it blank, it'll work even better. Nothing. Oh, you did not just go there. <laughs> you did. Oh. <laughs> Lois, it's too early in the morning to be thinking that way. Come on now. PG-13. The word of the show is for the purposes only. I didn't say anything, though. I didn't have to. <laughs> I could sense it wafting off of your body. And I looked over, and the expression on your face was everything I needed to know. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> It was oh, instantaneous. <laughs> terrible. Terrible, terrible. Check the comments over here. Indigo says, I uh, love the shirt, Lois. Why, thank you. Yeah. So do I, my, my little Batman. Yep. You don't do Batman. Mm -hmm. What are those things called? They're, they're I, like I dolls can't remember. with the weird eyes. Yeah, I can't remember. And they got big heads. It's like a bobble head, but bigger. Yeah, yeah. Look at the kind of <laughs> I forget the name of them. I, I think they're they're the new Beanie Babies, actually. Because <laughs> uh, uh, there are some that are <coughs> worth a lot of freaking money. Yes. So yeah, I think they're they're this generation's beanie babies. This generation's beanie babies. Oh man. I know. I'm oh old. man. I'm old. <laughs> I am not afraid to admit that I am old. Yeah, it's okay. I'm still dirt. So. <laughs> just saying. Just putting it out there for you, Lois. Uh, let's see. Carrie says, uh, I'm a foster mommy again. Two of the cutest fur balls ever. Yay! Awesome. Ooh. That's always exciting. Well, where, you got to put the pictures up in the network group, man. Come on. Uh, yeah. yeah. Where's the pictures? <laughs> Jeez, you can't say something like that and not put out the pictures. <laughs> we, 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 like the, we like the fur, fur balls. Yes, the fuzzies. <laughs> the ones that are cuter and less insane than ours. Oh, we had a conversation about that yesterday. Did we? Yeah. I don't about remember. about uh, dogs that eat things that they're oh. not supposed to. <laughs> yes, yes, we did. I tell you what, man. Those dogs. Oh, not That's a puppy. Horrifying. But, you know, in all honesty, it, it's nice to know that our dogs are not the only ones that do that. Yeah. yeah <laughs> this is true. But still, it's just like. Hey. And then you realize yours are much better behaved than a lot of other people's. And it's like, you know. Uh, I, don't know. I know. <laughs> it's still annoying. It is. Especially it is. when you got to pick it up out of the yard. That's all I'm saying. Really? I'm the one who picks it up. Whatever. <laughs> I got to watch it happen. It's like a yo yo, man. <laughs> That's just gross. Yes, it is. Yes, oh. It is. And I totally. Yeah. Oh, yeah. YY's got the glasses. <laughs> yep. Or, I'm sorry, not YY. Indigo. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! So yesterday was interesting. You so you guys remember last week? Uh, you know there was the whole rush to get everything done, and then there was Doomsday Sunday. It's gonna be Doomsday Friday. Yeah, yeah, we're Doomsday Sunday, where she had to get the homework done and turned in all the way to the last possible minute. She got it turned in. And she, oh, it's horrible. Anyway, she got another uh, message from the instructor for another best in class paper. <laughs> So, yeah. Apparently, you happen to know what's going on around here. Uh, apparently, I am truly my own worst critic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All week, we're like, I don't understand. Oh, yeah. Oh. The teacher's like, wow, that's amazing. And you're like, huh? <laughs> I, I don't. I, I, 
I, I do. I, I go through and evidently this is part of what takes me so long because I'm always second guessing myself. Right, but I think it's part of the process of getting best in class paper. <laughs> Again. <laughs> evidently. So congratulations, Alana. Oh, thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> Can we not have a Doomsday Friday, please? I'm trying not right. to because there is something that I want to do Friday, so. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. Yeah. So she got uh, the, the, this this week of the school week. Normally they end on Sundays, but this is the last one for these two classes, so they shorten the week by two days. So the last day of the week for these two classes is Friday, and she has a twenty-five page paper due. And what else? Um, I have another what seven hundred and fifty word page paper due, and. Responses to uh, um, discussion boards. It is Tuesday. Are you done yet? Really? Really? What? <laughs> I just have you done anything yet? Yes, I have. Ah, I have starting? one response, but I have uh, one response that I've done, but I have to cite it. Oh, well, that's not too bad. Uh, yeah. yeah, that's like your best thing. You like cite everything, and you've got like that APA <laughs> format stuff down to a science. I man. sort of have to. I had an APA Nazi for an instructor. Yeah, but you also took an APA <laughs> class. That too. I mean, it's just amazing. <laughs> you are really good at that. Though. Let's see. Um, oh. Jerry says, "Way to go, Lois." Yeah, Thank you. Thank see, you. there you go. <laughs> there you go. Carrie says, uh, "Don't get me started on the strange stuff dogs eat." Has my spawn of Satan eats anything and everything wood, knives, spatulas. Ugh, that's oh, gotta be a See now now that was one thing that I discovered with, with Bengal <laughs> is he he likes wood products. Uh -huh. Yes. And I was living in an apartment where they had a loft and the loft, you know, had pillars of wood. And he was chewing them like a freaking beaver. And so what I ended up doing was I got him one of the tempered logs that they use for the large parrots. Oh, okay. All right. And it worked beautifully. <laughs> every once in a while, this dog, but Mr. Bengal, every once in a while, you know, I'll, I'll bring in some wood to put in the wood stove. You know, and I'll have a nice pile sitting over there, and I will look over, and he will be straddling the wood pile, sniffing the logs, and occasionally he will grab one that's, you know, ten times the size of his head and try and I pick it up and walk off it. I'm like, no, no. Because the issue with it is not that he's chewing on it, but it is that there's splinters everywhere. <laughs> he's like a wood chipper. It's he like, is. no, he no, really no. is. <laughs> that dog has got issues, man. <laughs> but yeah, Carrie or, or anybody who, who owns a dog that has a, um, you know, a thing for lumber, mm -hmm. um, and go ahead and, and give give the, the parrot perches a try. Yeah. Because... It's a special kind of perch made yeah, for yeah. parrots so that they don't peck through it, I guess. I don't know. Actually, it's for their talents. Yeah, okay. It, yeah, so so they don't tear it apart. And apparently they're very resilient. And they are. It, it's almost like petrified wood. Well, yeah, but petrified wood's a rock. I, I realize, I that, <laughs> but that's why I said it's almost like... Almost like, all right. Because I was going to say, I mean, you know, that's that's Tigger's issue. She'll eat anything up to and including rocks. Uh, yes. Because that dog has got a couple of screws loose. That's all I'm saying. No, I think she's got rocks in her brain. <laughs> that too, yeah. Yeah, when she shakes her head, you can hear stuff rattling around. Yeah, that's yeah, all yeah. I'm saying. <laughs> that dog got some problems over there. Oh, no. Uh, Renee says, good morning. Good morning, Renee. Good morning, Renee. Good to see you. David and says, laissez le bon temps roulé. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> That's like redneck French right there. No, that no? I Creole? believe I believe it is Creole. All right. <laughs> Sounds good, man. And, oh yeah, it's fat. It is. Fat it Tuesday. is. <laughs> oh, my God. One of these years. One yeah. of these years. We'll get there eventually. Someday. <laughs> Jerry says, uh, "Let the good times roll, David. Happy Mardi Gras." Right. Yes. Yes. And uh, right. Renee says uh, her dogs try to eat wood too. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> And Diana says, uh, my beagle sits and eats greens with Hank, then he will go eat cat and bird. Ew! Thing. Yep. Ew! Vet said it's a delicacy and won't hurt them, but it hurts me. Yes. It, yes. It yes. actually is because the cats, uh, the cat cookies. I, I call them Kitty Krispies. Yeah, Kitty Krispies. <laughs> like Rice Krispies with the dark side. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, they're much higher in protein content because of the food that they eat. <laughs> them dogs just love crunchy <laughs> labor. Yeah, no. That's horrifying. Uh, uh, 
It really is. It's just nasty. It, 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 but no. dogs, dogs do weird stuff. Uh, they do. They do. And, and they're like, like horse hooves. They love the horse hooves, man. When you when you trim horse hooves, really? Oh, oh yeah, that's a high in protein, and it is a. Mm, 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 and it's like. <laughs> I never, <coughs> never knew that. Yeah, well, but, now you do. But I do. do. I did read a study once, and I don't remember how I got down that rabbit hole. <laughs> um, <laughs> But um, dogs apparently their their sense of smell is geared that they you know unless it is something truly truly rotten that will hurt them mm-hmm. they'll eat anything and everything. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, I can attest to that. Having been I a just, dog owner pretty much all of my life. It, yeah, I just no. And that's one of the things that cracks me up. You know, you've got you've got all these cool things and inventions out for pets like. Like a dog water purifier to make sure that they get the cleanest, purest water possible. That dog that you're feeding this purified water to two seconds ago eat a turd out in the front yard <laughs> or a kitty crispy out of the litter box and you're feeding them filtered water because you're worried about stuff? <laughs> that'll be fine. <laughs> so I gotta say, they'll be fine. It's okay. <laughs> Just don't let them kiss you afterwards. <laughs> oh. Kitty crispy breath, yummy. No. <laughs> Carrie says, uh, I'm going to have to try that. Taz has chewed my restored coffee tables. No. No. <coughs> no. She says, um, <coughs> wow. <coughs> Carrie, Carrie was is saying that uh, he chews the corners one at a time, and as she's patching them, he'll go to the next one. Little turkey. <laughs> oh, man. That's terrible. And Renee is, says, uh, Fat Tuesday. Yes. Fat Woo-hoo. Tuesday. So anyway, yeah, that's that's what dogs do. They just I've heard that uh and I know this is not true, at least in our experience, but I've heard that if you spray uh like a citrus thing, like an orange flavored stuff that smells orangey on things that it keeps dogs away. No. I, I have not noticed that to actually function. No, and then um I was told before I figured out <clears throat> to to replace the, the wood chewing with a parrot perch. Mm-hmm. Uh, I was told to use a. They have like a pepper um, pepper spray, a paprika or something like that. Okay. For for dogs, Bingo likes it. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? <laughs> it's supposed to be hot. And they're like, and and, and yeah, Bingo mm. enjoys it. And I'm going, oh man. <laughs> so that took me twice, and and then uh, a, lesson, a, a friend uh, suggested, let's try this. <laughs> and wow, lo and behold, it worked. <laughs> That's funny. Well, I know the the orange thing doesn't work because they use that orange spray oils, mm-hmm. you know, for like the wood stuffs, and it doesn't bug them at all. So. Uh, no, mm-hmm. no, no, no. Um, They're just like, eh, and the dogs like fruits and vegetables and stuff. That it's because they're on the floor. Well, Tigger likes anything that's on the floor, whether I, it falls there, whether it's there, yeah, whether it's does. dog hair, I, dirt, rocks. I don't rocks. use her as as the uh, as, as the example. Yeah, she's a shock back <laughs> with legs. <laughs> Doesn't matter what it is, man. That dog will eat everything. She will. She Ugh. will. <laughs> Horrifying. And Carrie says, I read my mind, Lois. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know, man. They're just... <laughs> yeah. They have issues. Mm, they do. They do. We love them to death, but man. Mm, I still don't things? get the rock thing. I, I, I don't know. I don't understand. Tigger will actually... Because we've got, we've got rock in the front yard. Not gravel. Rock. Okay, yeah. it's rock. I mean, this this stuff is it's like three quarter plus. I mean, it's big rock, mm-hmm. and it's nice rock. And we'll be out there, and everything will be normal. It doesn't happen all the time, but every once in a while, she'll reach down and pick it up. And at first, I thought it was like she was eating a turd, which for a dog is normal. But no, she ate rocks. This dog eats rocks, and she's in there crunching. I'm like, what are you doing? Knock it off. <laughs> You know, but you try and reach down there and snatch it out. She's just like, and I'm like, no! And she ate rocks, man. <laughs> maybe, maybe she's a bird reincarnate because uh, yeah, she's putting stones in her craw. Yeah. yeah, I was gonna say because I remember when when I had birds, we had to yeah, put, stick in little gravel bits to to help their digestive system. Yeah, they or put whatever. it in their craw. It helps yeah. grind up bird seed and then. Yeah. yeah. So uh, <clears throat> maybe maybe she's a bird reincarnated. No, I'm that. telling you, she's a shop vac with legs. <laughs> a furry shop vac with legs. That's all that is, man. I just because she roams around just, and it doesn't matter what it is, up it goes, man. Just like that. 
and then you get to find it the next day. I do. <laughs> what? And that's always not, exciting. Not hey. really, no. <laughs> uh, Carrie says, nope, doesn't work. Lemon juice, pepper spray, he's truly my temper tester. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, I understand how that Carrie says Tigger must be a goat from a past life. Maybe. Yeah, but maybe. I think she'd eat stuff a goat would puke at. I'm just saying. <laughs> <sighs> it reminds me of that line out of Rambo. You eat stuff that make a billy goat puke. <laughs> I, I, I know you don't yeah, know, yeah. Lois. It's, no, I don't. It's a Rambo thing, <laughs> man. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I, yeah, I, I know. I, I disappoint. I, I don't know. We love them to death, but man, it's some of this stuff. But we do have it better than some. We were talking yeah. to a friend of ours yesterday, and he was telling us some of the things that his his puppy does. And by puppy, I mean he thinks huge. It will destroy and eat everything. Hey, yeah. So we do have that where most of the time they behave themselves. Of course, hey, yeah. that I've said that. Uh huh. Pretty mm-hmm. much. I don't oh, know. goody, and they're locked in the office. In my office. Oh, yeah, that's going to be bad juju right there. Ah! I don't want to consider that. Don't want to kind of like, okay, says, uh, get out of my head, Lois. Password change. Oh, it's, it's, uh, it's Lois' turn. Yeah, Usually it's my exactly. issue. <laughs> Tana says, uh, eventually it'll hit rock bottom. Oh, oh yes, it does. Yeah. And that's not pleasant because then they sit there grunting and drooling like, uh, You mean it, like people? Yeah, pretty much. But then, you know, it's like passing a stone. Oh, oh, my. Yeah, sh- sh- ah, you went there. Dwayne says, good morning, good morning. Good, good morning, to see you. Oh, zombie mode. More coffee. Uh, uh, yep, yep. Need more coffee, Dwayne. <laughs> <laughs> and Renee says, I had a dog that ate lug nuts. Oh, really? Lug nuts? Wow. Oh. Well, you know, I can't really say anything because Tigger likes fireworks. <laughs> Well, yeah, but it's a lug nut. It's a hunk of steel, man. <laughs> what the heck? <coughs> yeah, you, yeah, your dog likes that, but it, you know. I, I just, and, and, <sighs> and I, yeah, I, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Freaking dogs, man. <laughs> dogs. <laughs> Love them to death, but at what least, the heck? At, at least, you know, um, Renee's able to take a really big magnet and find her dog if uh, if they ever get lost. <laughs> Metal detector, like, where are you? Beep, beep, beep. beep. Oh, there goes the internet. <laughs> Yay. Just keep going. I know. I'm going. I'm going. Dwayne says uh, garlic juice. No, they like garlic, too. They, yeah, they do. Uh, I don't know what's wrong. They just eat everything. Uh, uh, yeah. Horrifying. And Jerry says, uh, I caught my Cocker Spaniel eating his his stuff years Ew. ago. When I yelled at him, he looked at me with it hanging out of the side <laughs> of his mouth. Looked like a big cigar. <laughs> Oh, that's gross, but funny. <laughs> I got one worse for you, Jerry. Oh, no, no, oh, no. Oh, yeah, no, no we're totally no. going there. No, I'm... I'm <laughs> we're no, totally going there. listen to this. This was many, 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 many years ago. <clears throat> no. We didn't, you know, this is, I mean, this is a long time ago. Uh, we used to have the dogs, we had a dog run on the side of the house. And uh, we had, my dog was out there, my brother's dog was out there, and they'd be running around, <laughs> and... and uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is good. Are you okay, Lois? Oh, she can't handle it. <laughs> so it was time to let the dogs in and kick the back door open and I looked out there. And my dog was doing her business. You know, kind of making that face and looking up at the door. And behind the dog is my brother's dog eating it like a soft serve coming out of the tap. That's the most horrifying thing I've ever seen in my life. I was just like, ah! Oh, I had to close the door. I'm like, I can't open oh, Nope. Not doing it. Soft serve, man. Oh, man. It still scars the mind. I just... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right out of the tap. <laughs> the oh, horror of life. Horseshoe Ben says, hey, hey, hey. Good Welcome, Horseshoe Ben. You joined in a weird, inopportune time. <laughs> Good to see you. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Dave says, uh, why are you complaining about having an industrial Roomba? <laughs> Think about the savings and money you could make marketing those if you could genetically engineer. <laughs> you know what? He's got a point No! There. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now no, that I've no. horrified everyone. Oh, the wave's <laughs> waving. Hello! <laughs> Thanks for being here, wave. Oh, everybody joined at the worst time. I'm just, yeah, there's Renee. Just, oh. I'm not saying it's aliens, but <laughs> it's aliens. That's just nasty. Oh yeah, Je- or Antelope Cade says, "What up? Good to see you, Antelope Cade." 
Thanks, guys, for being here. You guys, man, you just jumped right in the ho- most horrible part of the morning show. We're right there. <laughs> now you're going to be scarred for life. Oh. And Jerry's going, ah, 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 ah. Yeah. It, Let me tell you something. No matter what you can visualize and imagine, unless you were there, the no, true no, horror no, no, of no. it I, uh, just doesn't quite sink in. No. I'm scarred for life. Yeah, and I am, too, from just hearing about it. <laughs> and Renee's going, ah. Yeah, it was, it was bad, man. <laughs> it was bad. And, and Carrie says, I often wonder how his intestines are still intact, but the hyper excitement and the tuck and run that follows a bathroom break says it all. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. It's, it makes you wonder. It makes you wonder. Uh-oh. Yeah, they're industrial Uh-oh. garbage disposals. I don't know. Yeah, they are. <laughs> <laughs> but once again, that goes back to my filtered dog water. I mean, really? <laughs> really? You're going to give them filtered dog water? They just did that. That's all I'm saying. Mm, yeah, yeah, save your money. It's okay. That'd be fine. <laughs> <laughs> no. I guess it might make you feel better about the whole thing. You never know. I, I, I didn't. Nope. <laughs> oh, anyway. Oh, on so many levels. Yeah, all right. I, so I've many. horrified poor You Lois have. You yeah. have. And, and you were muffled. I could hear most of what you were... Th- Stop it! <laughs> I could hear most of what you were saying, and it didn't help with the muffling. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> yeah, you is right. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't even know. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Okay, so I guess moving on to other topics <laughs> of the day. Did we do anything yesterday? So you had meetings and mm-hmm. stuff? That would be about yeah. it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, yeah, our internet was amazing yesterday, as you guys very well know. Um, that that yeah. was exciting. Yeah, meetings you know, and... Oh, oh, yeah, I remember. Uh-oh. So so you went to bed early last night. It, yes. Which means I was going to go to bed at my normal time. I actually tried to do something for over, I don't know, 30 minutes last night. I was trying to play that Star Trek game I told you about. I finally gave up because I couldn't get it to work. Oh, wow. Yeah. I was like, fine, screw it. Yay. I didn't even know why about it. Yeah, that oh, was fun. Oh, no. That, that sucks. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know, man. That that uh, the tin cans and the string that make up our internet. They're frayed. Yeah. It's fra- <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I have to get a hold of them again and be like, hey, you know, do you think maybe you could possibly make this crap work? Because I do pay for it. Just saying. <laughs> But, you know, oh, and just, just speak of the devil, there goes the internet. <laughs> We've gone to plan. They, they got mad at you. <laughs> they did. Oh, yeah, it dropped so, all the way down to zero. So keep going. <laughs> Murphy, Murphy Tuesday. Oh, speaking of Tuesdays, if we are doing the Max Headroom thing, I do apologize. But hopefully you can still hear us. It is Tuesday, so if you have trash days on Tuesday, today's that day. Yes. Yeah, it's, our internet's completely uh, well, cut. No, it's at zero. I saw that, but just keep going, because it was at zero yesterday, and we kept going. No, we had, we had like an 80% oh packet Oh, my last goodness. Minute. Go. <laughs> <laughs> just keep going. Uh, As Dory says, just keep swimming. Just yeah, keep yeah. Swimming. Carrie says, uh, filter dog water to go with my organic wood. <laughs> I'm not touching that one. <laughs> David says, my eyes are bugging out of my head. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> Horrifying no, stuff. No, no. <laughs> <coughs> So apparently our internet is fluctuating. We'll, we'll keep uh, going in and out here. <laughs> Stick with us. Hopefully it'll stay. Uh, yes. And you stop doing that because that's really obnoxious. Sorry. I'm just saying. <laughs> we'll just turn it off right now. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> anyway, um, so do we have anything going on today other than trash day for today, Lord? Mm, like homework. I've already started on the news. Yeah. <laughs> So, oh, yeah, but there is an interesting it. article that she did put out on the website today about yes. the water thingamabobber, you know, conservation <laughs> thingy. <laughs> the thingamabobber. It's a thingamabobber. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> She's laughing at me. I don't even know what it is. A water thingamabobber, huh? Yeah, a water thingamabobber. <laughs> it's about the, the water can kind of... Bleh. It's the know. drought contingency. Then that's <laughs> it. It's too early in the morning for that. Oh, my But we goodness. do have the anthropomorphic personifications of several <laughs> of oh. our local monuments in here. So I, I'm just, I can say that, but I can't say that. <laughs> I don't know, man. I just... I don't know what. Oh, no. Yeah, pretty much. Oh. So anyway, there's an article so, out on that. Make sure you guys yeah. check it out. We failed the deadline again. Us and California. Us and California. Although California, eh, it's normal. Actually, um, California is being seen as, as the largest holdout between the two. Oh, really? Um, 
So and, it's their and, fault. We can blame them. Well, yeah. for us, we're, um, for Arizona, we were actually, and, and Arizona still is working with um, the major partners that are going to be affected mm-hmm. and, and still trying to get those agreements done. But with California, there is one area mm-hmm. that is holding out. And they're throwing a governmental temper tantrum. Oh, jeez. Why am <laughs> and, I not surprised? And, and the funny thing is, is I, I was looking at, at some of the, the statements from, from this district. Mm-hmm. And um, they, were, they were saying, you know, really what it is, is they're holding out and have been mm-hmm. on, on signing off on California's contingency plan. Okay. Um, until the feds pay... Two hundred million dollars to help them restore a certain water area. Ugh. Now, th- what they're saying <laughs> is, with the feds coming in, it's holding them hostage. And it's like, wait, what? <laughs> yeah, I don't even know how to <laughs> say that. That sounds like normal California BS. So. <laughs> and the and the hilarious thing is, is they are the largest water users from the basin. The rest of us have cut back. Yeah, they haven't. It. It's California. And it's like wow, and 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 one of the the things that I saw when I was researching this article was in California's allotted over four million cubic whatever of water. Okay, <laughs> there's a lot of acre feet. It, oh, oh, there you go, cubic acre feet. <laughs> no, acre feet. It's not cubic acre feet because uh, that wow. It is. No, acre feet. It, it said C. It had a C in there. All right. <laughs> Just either it, way, either it's way. It's measured in acre feet. Cubic so, acre feet, that's a whole nother ball of wax. Man. <laughs> either way, it's over 4 million whatever that they're allowed feet, yeah. for, for the water. Okay. And this district receives over 3 million of it. <laughs> <sighs> anyway, all right, moving on to the things that are more interesting than idiots in <laughs> California. <clears throat> and it's like, wait a minute. Yeah, what? pretty much. <laughs> Renee says, uh, it's a Mad Max kind of day. Yeah, yeah, sorry, pretty much. Renee. Sorry. <laughs> Dave says, uh, after that scarring story, I now see into the future as Lois is being interviewed. Yes, he was a good man. But if I had to pinpoint the turning moment when I think he changed, the moment that truly stained his soul and caused him to snap on that tourist today, there was the one time he told me about his dog. <laughs> Nice. That's a good one. I love that name. I will have to read it. And said, hi, I hi, I see you. <laughs> Diana says, uh, almond tree is supposedly huge at water usage and at the California. Yes, house. yes. They've always got an excuse. But the, the funny thing is, you know, the, the, the Bureau of Reclamation said, they said, you need to come up with this stuff or we're coming in and we're going to tell you what to do with uh, yeah. it. So here we are. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll see what happens. I don't know. <clears throat> it's a bunch of kids fighting over scarce resources. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, pretty much. We'll see what happens. It's going to be interesting either way. But there is an article about it on the website. Don't yes, forget to is. check it out. And uh, you can also see it here in the Facebook feed. <laughs> interesting. It, it is. It is. We'll, we'll see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> Um, all right, now I guess let's go ahead and jump on into stuff. All righty. Well, what since we've been talking animals. about animals this morning. And am, 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 animals. 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 What you got? <laughs> all right, go to animals. Oh. I only have one. Wow. <laughs> it says, oh boy. <laughs> yeah, we, we think our animals are bad. Mm. Yeah, pretty much. Not as bad as these guys. Uh-oh. I gotta turn down uh, my volume uh, just boy. in case. It really, it, wow. And you're always getting on me about the volume on my phone. Yeah, because yours actually starts making noise. Mine hasn't done anything yet. Yet. Yeah. <laughs> and now it won't. Oh, I caught it. Wait a minute. What? <laughs> this is horrifying. <laughs> Here's the headline <laughs> Opium addicted parrots terrorize Indian poppy farmers. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. At least our animals are not this bad. <laughs> Holy cow. Opium addicted parrots terrorize Indian poppy farmers. That is. That's hilarious. This is like the flying monkeys out of Wizard of Oz, man. <laughs> Puppies! <laughs> Puppies! <laughs> Oh no! And it's got a picture of these parrots flying around. You, yeah, I think that's stock footage. It, I don't know, man. But <laughs> it's holy cow! It's like the birds. Alfred Hitchcock would be proud. <laughs> and they've learned. Holy actually, have they? This has been going on since 2015. Okay. The birds have learned, uh-huh. and and um, the the people who put this article together interviewed 
some of the workers and, and people in the industry. Okay. And they said back in 2015, the birds would make noise as they were going through the fields. Oh, okay. They don't anymore. They're just quiet. They're quiet. Silent but deadly parrots. Uh, yes. And they're actually attacking the farmers? Uh, no, they're they're oh. going after the poppy. Oh, okay. All right. And they're going after the seeds, which, you know, is, is used to make medicines and stuff. Yeah, medicines. We'll go with that. Uh-huh. <laughs> Because that's what they do with the majority of it. They make medicine. Yeah, I'm just right. saying. I'm just saying. I'm telling that line. Um, and, and they're destroying the crops. <laughs> so, yeah. so, you know what? This this goes, that whole war on drugs that we've got going on over here. All you got to do, apparently, is train parrots. <laughs> I'll take care of all of them. <laughs> yeah, what, they, what the parrots used to do is they would they would squawk to let the other parrots know that. Like, hey, that, it's over here. It, yeah, and now they don't. They do it as they're leaving. They sweep <laughs> in quietly, clean the place. Out. It's like a plague of locusts. <laughs> it's parrots. That's pretty and, funny. And, yeah. and the workers are trying to figure out how to scare the parrots away. <laughs> they're using wet drums and uh, firecrackers and all, all sorts of things. Have they tried a scarecrow? Uh, 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 Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> but even the loud noises aren't scaring them. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's funny right there. They're just getting immune to it, huh? Oh, that's hilarious. Uh, Ed says uh, avocados, too. Yep, 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 definitely. And uh, Chinatown gives you a lot of history on California. Watch. Oh, watch Chinatown. Okay. And uh, that's because the birds are too stoned to make noise. <laughs> yeah, probably. I don't know, man. Oh, no. <laughs> and he says the Adventures of Rupert, Episode 2 preview. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, man. That's getting good. But, so, so yeah, these uh, they don't know if the par- parrots are addicted because no one's... You actually know, done a study on it. Uh, right. No. They're just they're just assuming that they are. They're just like, oh, this stuff is good. That's pretty much. <laughs> yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> Oh, and what they'll do is they'll wait until the workers, I, I guess there's a, a way that they, they work the, the poppy plant mm. um, or the flower, and they'll wait till the workers split the seed. Okay. And that's when they'll swoop in. They split the seed for it to actually do something, Yeah. and then they leave t- for whatever to happen, Who have happened. Oh, okay, all right. And then that's when the parrots... They just... <laughs> that's when the parrots... I want some video of this, man. That's all I'm saying. That could be funny. <laughs> so, yeah, that one... Uh-huh. <laughs> that one tickled my fancy this morning. parrots. <laughs> you know, the, you remember a while back we were talking about the parrot that was uh, that, that had escaped and was yes. cursing at people yes. on roofs? Yes, yes. I, 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 I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez! Oh no! Uh, uh, let's see. David says uh, we do have grass-eating cows. Take that grass, says you. <laughs> <laughs> Ali says, "Oh my goodness, those parrots are for real." I saw the video. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll have to look up the video later. Yeah, we'll have to check out a video. That sounds interesting. <laughs> those guys are crazy. Man. It is. <laughs> they are. Oh, wow. They are. And um, there was one that came across this morning, but I I messaged you, but. Anyway, oh, I actually um, have that up. Still. Do you? Yes, I do. do you? Are you talking about? Oh, yes, talking about the i seventy. Uh, no, no, right. I, I messaged you a different one. No, oh, then I have no the, idea. That one right there. Oh, yeah, oh, this, this one. Yeah, this Ooh. actually came across my feed, and and I would do the i seventy, except our internet is weird. Yeah, um, it's not weird. It sucks. Yeah, well, that too. The difference. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. All right, so this is actually it's interesting. It sounds absolutely horrifying to me. It, it, it does. It does. I'm making it uh, better for you guys so you guys can see. Here. One of them sounds tasty. Ah, and this is know. obviously food. <laughs> yes, it's food related. <laughs> Lois has lost her mind. I it, well, I don't think I ever really had it. Oh, that's true. Well, you you do you do know me, so I guess I can help. <laughs> All right, so mm, this is the uh, the headline here. M&M's introduces three new flavors, including jalapeno peanut M&M's. No, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay, so it says, hey, m M&M and fans, M&M's has rolled out three new unique flavors for a limited time. The new flavors include jalapeno peanut M&M's, English toffee peanut M&M's, and... Thai coconut peanut M&M's. That is horrifying. I'm going to... It doesn't have the thing on. Oh, yeah, it does. Yeah, it's on the thing. Okay, so there we go. 
Oh, just Lois. So as you can see there, <laughs> it's insane. And the the, the the top corner up over. Oh, there it goes the internet again. Uh, at the top corner over there, it says Mexican jalapeno peanut M and M's. That sounds uh-uh. horrifying. And no, thank you. I mean, you. I'm sure there's somebody out there that's gonna. Try I can it, but... guarantee it, but mm-mm. and and I I'm okay with trying the English toffee. Okay. Because to me, English yeah, toffee is okay. I, I like English toffee. I can see it. The Thai coconut sounds a little interesting. Because with Thai food, you've got the, the coconut and the peanut sauces anyway. Yeah. So yeah, that could know, be man. interesting yeah. if they did it right with the chocolate. But it's but an m M&M because it's got a hard candy shell. It's weird, man. I know. But I, I, know. I might be willing to give it a whirl at some point. <laughs> just to say I did it. No. That's all I got. I don't know. <laughs> These are just interesting. Uh, Carrie says they are probably quiet only after eating and nodding off. Oh, uh, Anne's going to that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Dave says, uh, I'm in. The candy corn Hershey's was good. Man, well, well, you know what? Yeah. There's our guinea pig right there. Yeah. Dave, get to work. <laughs> <laughs> Try the jalapeno peanut. Michael <laughs> says a uh, jalapeno flavored peanut M&M's. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. No way. I know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no. Oh. I'll try the other two. I, I, just, I, I'm just... Mm, I can't do it, man. jalapeno. Jerry <laughs> says, uh, how could you not want to try one with that yellow M&M wearing hat sombrero? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's and good. And he is holding a, a, a bunch of uh, jalapeno peppers. Yeah, he is. He's holding them. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. Mm. And uh, let's see. Trish says, the jalapeno is not good. Have you tried it? I, I think so. Oh, all right. <laughs> Well, there we go. We got one vote that says, Yeah, thank you. It sounds <laughs> horrifying. I just don't. It, it, yeah, I. Uh, no. No, no, no. Uh, that. That just, uh, it just sounds wrong. It does. It oh, does. I, I just couldn't do it. <laughs> the other two, definitely. The, the Thai coconut? I, 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 I would give it a try. I would give it a uh, try. Yeah, and I suppose just to see what it was. Although, I did, I still haven't even tried those cotton candy flavored grapes that they're growing Oh, now. that's true. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh, just maybe you can test them. I want to see if they turn into plasma that's in the microwave. That's what I said. Test them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is on my experiment list, by the way. <laughs> You have a very long experience. I do, I do. (laughs) Dave says, just wait, I'm sure someone will cry cultural appropriation and they will be required to remove the hat. Yes, that, and apparently they're Mexican jalapeno. What what, what if, what if they're not, the jalapenos aren't from Mexico? What if they were from, I don't know, somewhere else? (laughs) I'm not going there, that's another (laughs) I don't know, cultural appropriation. Apparently Eminem's going to get in trouble now. Oh, I'm, come I'm on, Lois. Oh, <laughs> warning, this show is for entertainment purposes only. See, now we're safe. <laughs> <laughs> now we can make fun of everybody. Uh, oh, Lord, no. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, three new horrifying flavors of M&Ms are out there. You know, it's funny that uh, that, that they're doing this because there's, uh, what is it? There's like Snickers and Kit Kats and stuff, uh, you know, over uh, like in, in Asia and stuff where they have weird uh, weird flavors. <laughs> Sorry. I, 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 <laughs> they've got weird flavors, and they only manufacture them over there, especially yes. like in Japan and stuff like yes. that. And it's just like bizarre, like fish flavored, you know? It's like, what the? But they love the stuff. They, they do. They so, do. I mean, to each their own, but... Uh, <laughs> 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 no, no, no. Not for these two things. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm not going for it. Uh, Trish says, uh, yes, I did. They're terrible. Ugh, uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> did you find them here locally? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, where, where'd you find them at? And uh, Ali says, Thai coconut? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah I'm you right guys there. Are there. Yeah. yeah, because Thai coconut, it, it, it's, it, it has a different taste. Well, yeah, it's Thai coconut. I meant different from regular coconut. Oh, I thought you were going to say different from regular M&M's. No bleep and bleep. (laughs) (laughs) Just say it. No. (laughs) Like, yeah, that would be different. I think that's the whole point. Oh, my goodness. No, Thai coconut has its own flavor. I don't know if I've ever had Thai coconut. You probably have if if you've had Thai food, real Thai food. But I do have... A lovely bunch of coconuts. Deedly, deedly, no, you have a one. There, standing in the road. <laughs> hey, stop messing with my song. <laughs> <laughs> it's still got the stuff. It, it better because, you know, it hasn't been opened yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so how do, do I make, how do I make this a Thai coconut? Do I just pour curry on it and eat it? <laughs> what? Come on, man. Oh, Work with me here. I, I'm trying to be inventive with my coconuts. Oh, my. 
I didn't just for him. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, 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 man. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> uh, and then Ellie says, uh, no, definitely not to the jalapenos. Uh, Gary says, I wonder if they... Uh, oh, wait a minute, what? Oh, oh, the birds, the birds. Oh, the birds. Okay, Carrie says, I wonder if they nod off during flight just dropping out of the sky. <laughs> you know what? That might have something to do. You know how they've been having those mass bird die-offs? Uh, uh, yeah. Hmm. That, Maybe they're related. I don't know. I don't know. Diana says, uh, Mama Lois box suggestions. Hey, there you yeah. go. <laughs> and it's green, so it won't, you won't be able to <laughs> <Yeah>. see it. <laughs> uh, Carrie says, Thai coconut. And Trish is saying, Walmart. That is pretty good. All right. All right. All right. The Thai is pretty good, she says. Okay. Oh, nice. Right. We'll have to go check it out then. Oh, Carrie. <clears throat> Excuse oh. me. Sorry. Ah, that's gross. Carrie says, Jalapeno chocolate shakes. It's on it. Do they have Ew. those? That sounds horrifying. <laughs> uh, Diana says, uh, put the lime in the coconut and add the m and <laughs> I like it. That's funny. <laughs> and I love the fact that you just automatically started singing it. Do you know how what? my brain works? This is this how these what? things go, man? <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, my goodness gracious. Uh, Carrie. Carrie. Oh, oh, Carrie. No. That's a different show, Carrie. <laughs> Jerry says, uh, you two could get all three flavors at once. Walmart and taste test them live on air tomorrow. Challenge accepted. Oh, <laughs> We're doing it tomorrow. And that means I'm going to die because I don't do hot stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do the hot stuff. I, I was wondering oh, about I that if with stuff. the jalapeno, if they're hot or if they're if it's like a jalapeno juice. You know what the worst part is? Is It's going to be first thing in the morning. I'm going to have coffee and then... Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm getting a little bit of gaggy right here. <laughs> <'cause> I, uh, <laughs> I'm not saying it's aliens, but it's aliens. Oh, no. <laughs> Eating hot, spicy stuff first thing in the morning does not sound like a good but idea. But you just said challenge accepted. Yeah, it we'll do it. <laughs> we will do it. We will go down to Walmart and get to these, uh, okay. these m and we, we of will. Them. We will. <laughs> Blech. <laughs> oh, man. You know, that's good. you know what? Maybe that's why they're putting this stuff out. So people more companies, and... yeah. Well, yeah, more companies are coming out with weird stuff. Maybe they're trying to get it to go viral on like YouTube or uh, Facebook or something. I, I don't know. People testing them and going. Ooh, ah, I don't hey. know, but the thing is, is, is when they do a mass reveal or or whatever into the market, they've already tested a market. Yeah, this is true. <laughs> yeah, they so, have lots of money to do this. Where sort of did thing. they test this? I don't know. Man. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I already have one person that says the jalapeno ones are horrifying. Uh-huh. So. I, can, I can already picture. I'm like, <laughs> make oh. it stop. Maybe we'll have to have glasses of milk with us. Oh, yeah, we, I guess we do need to get some milk to go with that. Oh, we? my goodness. Oh. Yeah, that's hard. Yeah, those we can't do because no, we'll, we'll, is, we'll share. We do terrifying. have one that we want to share on our timeline. We will here. Yeah. A little bit later, but because of the way the internet's behaving, no videos for you today. Uh, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> All right, what else do you got for us today, All right, Alice? We're going to go to the last link under people. A last link under people. Is it the missing link? <laughs> 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 no, I didn't even think of that. <laughs> I got it, man. The last <laughs> link under people. It's the missing link. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, okay. I was like, what's going on? I don't even know. What? <laughs> I didn't even know this was a thing. Is it really? I, I did not know it was a thing. Right, so here's the headline for you. This doesn't even make sense to me. World's number one bridge player. Bridge the card game, I'm assuming. It's, yes. So world's number one bridge player suspended for juicing up. And by juicing up, I'm assuming some kind of stuff that enhances their playing abilities. <laughs> it's it's a card game. <laughs> <laughs> Do they I, randomly drug test you for playing bridge? I thought that was like a professional athlete thing. This is a card game. What? I don't understand. Help me out, Lois. Help me out. Read the comments out. while I try okay. to read. Uh, read the comments? Here, over our oh, comments. I thought you meant on the wow. thing. Wow. <laughs> I thought you meant on the thing, Lois. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see. Hold on. I'm working on it. 
Tree says no, they aren't hot, not even spicy. Okay, that's okay, good. So okay, so it's just They a just flavor. taste icky. <laughs> uh, let's see. Michael says, I'd like to see you guys taste test them on air tomorrow. Yep. All we right, will do we that. will do it. Dave says, it's candy. Buck up, sissy boy. <laughs> <laughs> we already accepted the challenge. I'm going to be there. I, I love how you say we. <laughs> You're part of the no, show. I, I, it means I, you got to do what I say. <laughs> Suck it up. <laughs> nope. Yep. <laughs> That's how that works. No. <laughs> oh, man. So, anyway, back to this article. So, it, how the heck can you get busted for juicing when you're... Car- Scroll down. I don't, I I don't, don't understand remember this. the name of the organization. Scroll down. Oh, they're going to say <laughs> organism. Oh. <laughs> Where am I scrolling, man? So, okay. Um, this poor guy. So, the World Bridge Federation. They have that? Apparently. Apparently, I'm just not traveling in the right circles, because I, whatever, I don't even know what to say that. The World Bridge Federation. Uh, yes, yes. Hey, right. <laughs> if you guys know what they're talking about, more power to you. No so, idea. the World Bridge Federation is a true thing. They follow the same rules and have been acknowledged by um, those who run the Olympics. What? For I just, okay. And so, right. because they're so. following the same rules, uh-huh. they randomly test, and this guy tested for performance-enhancing drugs, yet he was not using them to enhance his performance. What the heck? <laughs> I don't and, even and, know what to say to that. And, and the drugs themselves were not performance-enhancing. But he's been stripped of his 2018 titles. Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you still? Oh, I can't. I just can't wrap my head around this. Number one, that this is a thing. Number two, that there's there they have the same st- stuff as the Olympics, and now they're they're randomly drug testing for performance enhancing drugs. Because and this guy pops positive for playing cards, and they strip his title. How did that even work? <laughs> the world is gone, man. We're all toast. I don't even know what's going on anymore. This doesn't make any sense at all. Drugs could you use that could performance enhance your bridge plane? I have no idea. Ask the parrots. They know. <laughs> They've got the secrets right there. I don't, how does that I even work? I, I don't Is know. it caffeine but pills? He, what? He tested positive for drugs that are banned. And they're not performance enhancing. One of them was an estrogen. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait a minute. What? <laughs> All right, now we're going down the rabbit hole. We're not supposed to have purposes only. I don't even know what's going on anymore. So this dude shooting up estrogen to make his bridge play game better? They don't, they don't actually say what he was using them for, but what was found in his system, uh-huh. um, the drugs that were found in his system are not typically used to enhance any type of performance. Then why are they on the list for performance enhancing drugs that they test for? You're going to have the Olympics, people. That does not <laughs> make any sense. No wonder the hell we're just all what? the whole world Boom, right there. Hell in a handbag. Boom. I don't even know what happened right there. This is ridiculous. I don't even know what to say to that. It just boggling my mind. Carrie says uh, yes, they have them, but the hell? Oh, Paula. <laughs> I'll be uh, yucky texture. Okay, all right. Uh, Dave says uh, bridge juicing. Od on uh, geritol. <laughs> no, actually, he's in his twenties. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, man. David says, uh, "Keep your receipt and tax deduct those Walmart test purchases." <laughs> good idea. Good idea. Uh, Carrie says, uh, "I drank Insure before my shuffleboard game. Now I'm banned for a season." <laughs> oh, you're killing me, Carrie! You're killing me. Oh man, that's a good one. Uh, Carrie's young. <laughs> Dave says, uh, oh, taking the hormones so he can compete as a female the next year. Makes sense now. Uh, this, I knew this was going to happen. It's going downhill. Uh, David says, uh, the answer is found in... Jellyfish? Jellyfish? That sounds familiar. I don't know. I don't know, but it does sound familiar. It sounds like jellyfish, but I yeah. don't think I don't that's what he means. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, that is just bizarre. Mm-hmm. That they test for performance enhancing drugs and that they're accepted by the Olympics. Since when is Bridge an Olympic sport? 
It, well, apparently they are because what? they got accepted into it. Uh, no, and they no, got to meet the same standards. They're acknowledged by them and they've incorporated. There's some sort of finagled. Uh, Somebody's got a buddy over there. They're like, yeah, sure, let's go ahead and do that. Probably. <laughs> <sighs> I don't even know what to say. That is crazy. <laughs> That's nuts. Wait, what? Are you. I just. I, I can't. I can't, Lois. I can't. <laughs> that is just insanity. Oh, right, look, oh, oh. I think we got enough time for like one, one or two more there. Okay, what else okay. do you got? So, Let's get away from the crazy old people slash young people. Um, apparently, they're playing bridge and doping themselves for <laughs> performance enhancement. <laughs> that is apparently not performance enhancement, but they test for performance. It doesn't make any sense at all. None of it does. Anyway, moving on. So scroll down to miscellaneous <laughs> since you brought up going to going to hell in a handbasket. Whoa! <laughs> all right, what do you got? That one right there. This one? Yep. All right, what you got here? What you got? Uh-oh. I think our internet may have... Uh, oh, Uh-oh. Oh, it's thinking about it. Nope. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, Yay! Oh, 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 it's thinking about it. <laughs> Come on, strings and tin can. What? <laughs> what the heck? Oh, I did see this. This is so bizarre. It is. It this is. This is very strange. So you guys may or may not have seen this, but there is... Okay, so here's the headline for you. Mystery over how a whale ended up in the Amazon jungle. Mm-hmm. You know, you've got plagues of locusts. You've got plagues of plagues. You've got the, you know, just <laughs> all kinds of weird stuff. And now there's apparently whales falling out of the sky in the jungle. <laughs> is it, I don't, how does that even happen? Uh, they're trying to figure it out. You know, I, I, I know with storms and stuff, they it can transfer um, a fish and, yeah. and, you know, sea life. But yeah, this is a little bigger it, than a fish, man. Yeah. It's a whale. I know. <laughs> I'm just, it's eight meters long and six meters wide. <laughs> I and know. was found 15 meters from shore. Oh, okay. Well, that's a little bit closer, but I was thinking, see, it says jungle. I'm pictured in my head, middle of the Amazon rainforest, bam, there's a whale. So at least it was close to the shore. That makes a little more sense. Not really. Not as exciting now. Now I'm just like, oh, that could happen. Uh, Diana says, uh, another show. All right. <laughs> Uh, Gina says they may use estrogen for transitioning. Uh, yeah, but, but apparently it's performance enhancing that's not performance enhancing that they kissed for, and now we get his title strip. I don't <laughs> even know, man. I don't even know. <laughs> Carrie says Viagra. Not in honey. <laughs> Diana says, uh, why not? Beer pong is a Vegas sport. Yes, but is it regulated by the Olympic Committee and tested for uh, performance enhancement? Is beer a performance enhancing drug? Some would say yes. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> It depends on the performance. Oh, man. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. And the perception. <laughs> <coughs> so this isn't nearly as crazy as I thought it was because it's still near the shore. But it, it's still... It could have been a rogue wave, man. No, actually, I don't... They're, they're, they're not thinking that. Then what happened? Did it get up there and start that's crawling in? That's what they're trying to figure out. No, cause it, it wouldn't have because it was found upside down. No. Oh. <laughs> Maybe he was out there like sunning was... himself. I don't know. What? <laughs> oh, I heard you wrong. Sunning himself. I don't even want to know what you heard. That is, I don't know, man. Sheesh. Turn the show for them for Brazil. Then I lost you the mind there. What is going on? I never had it to begin oh, with. Yeah. We've already discussed this. All right, all right. Just today. <laughs> I don't even know. So, yeah, like I said, in my mind, when I read that headline, that's what I saw. Middle of the Amazon rainforest, boom, there's a whale. Yeah, that, that's what it's I on the beach, at least. It's on the beach. I mean, that's at least a little more normal. <laughs> at least there is a body of salty water where it may have once lived next to it. Uh, is is the river, or the, the water he came out of salty? Well, since whales live in the ocean, my guess would be yes. Uh, no, scroll down, because <laughs> I don't... <laughs> On an island northeast of Brazil, so yeah, I guess. Yeah, uh huh. <laughs> yeah, it's in the Amazon jungle. Blah blah blah. Uh, it was a oh, it's a humpback whale. Oh my goodness, I know exactly what happened. This is solved. I've got it. There's a movie on it already. Star Trek Four: The Voyage Home. They had to go get two humpback whales and take them back to the future so that an alien probe would not destroy the planet. This was apparently one of their failed attempts. And uh, Scotty accidentally jettisoned the whale over the Amazon jungle. Ta-da! Problem solved. I figured it out. 
Hello, computer. <laughs> Hello, computer. <laughs> <laughs> what? It, it makes perfect sense now. I got it solved. All they had to do was ask me. I know everything. <laughs> or I know nothing. It depends on your perspective. <laughs> oh, oh, man. No. I'm just oh, saying. No. What? I'm just... <laughs> Gary says that he wanted to be able to... Uh, oh, we're still on the... <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. It doesn't make any sense to me. But anyway, so, you know, I have solved this particular mystery. I'm just saying. It's a Star Trek thing. That's what happened. And what they didn't show in the movie was that was not their first attempt. That was their successful attempt. <laughs> Apparently, they had to go back in time more than once. <laughs> Like, very funny, Scotty now beam down the... Anyway. Oh. <clears throat> what? <laughs> okay, you scroll down, because now I want to know more. All oh, I saw boy. was the headline. Come on. Let's see. Okay, I... I'm like... Okay, what do you want here? I don't know. All right, never mind. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, okay, so it's all scientific. Mine's better. Yeah. I like my explanation better. I just saying. I do. I like mine. It's a Star Trek thing. Star Trek 4. I think we got another comment. <laughs> we'll check the comments real quick. Carrie says, uh, what someone's in-laws are visiting in the Amazon jungle. <sighs> I like it. That's fun. All right, guys. That is all we have time for today. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for liking, commenting, and sharing on all of these videos. We really do appreciate yes, it. thank you. Make it an epic day. And don't forget, it is Trash Tuesday, if that is your normal trash day, here in Page, Arizona. <laughs> and for the rest of you, have a good one. David, have fun out at Mardi Gras and pictures. <laughs> <laughs> don't try and post them. <laughs> <laughs> Just send them. <laughs> oh, we got another comment. <laughs> All right, hold on. Let's see. Check the comments one more time here. Diana says, or Scotty beamed him back missing the ocean. Yeah. And Dave says, uh, maybe it was carried. Swallows are not strangers to our lands. <laughs> Was it a laden or unladen swallow? African or European? Oh, good Lord. <laughs> oh, no. All right, right, guys. You have an amazing one, and we will catch you on the next one. Until yes. then, who's ready for a I am. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs>